Yeah, so I'm going to be talking about um, recent developments in the genetics of breast cancer, in particular the identification over the last couple of years of about 10 new genes which increase a woman's risk of, of the disease. And um, this is a major new development because uh, we've known from a, a, a number of years of genes which cause a high risk of breast cancer, genes like BRCA1 and BRCA2 that are used routinely in cancer genetics. But what we've been able to find more recently is genes which are where there are common variants in the population, uh, each of which increases a woman's risk somewhat. And one of the issues that we're, we're trying to address is um, if we put all these variants, these variants in these genes together, whether we can define a risk profile in the population to identify more women who are at high or low risk of the disease. Well, my research group focuses very much on, on predisposition to cancer. And so as well as breast cancer, we also look at the genetics of prostate cancer, ovarian cancer, testicular cancer, and a number of other cancers, trying to identify the genes involved in these diseases, uh, how they interact together, how they interact with lifestyle factors, uh, and also to look at ways in which the disease can be prevented.